it all comes down to getting the two plants running and needing to really push through as much of this ground as we can. I'm gonna just talk to Mitch about all this stuff and make sure that they're on track. To get both plants running, Parker turns to foreman Mitch Blaschke. How's it going? Good, how are you? Oh, not too bad. Trying to make some headway here. Getting two plants up and going, this is a critical move of the year, right? I'm gonna go over to Fairbanks, so I'm not gonna be here. Do you feel comfortable about where you're at? Big Red's doing a good job down there, but we're falling behind on getting through the square footage we need to without two plants going. Yeah. When you get back, hopefully we've got uh, wash plant pad done, sluice first set in there. Two plants going. Two plants banging. All right, see you, man. Sounds good, man. Have a good trip. Parker's leaving to get the wheels in motion on the Alaska claim he plans to open in just weeks. Mitch is left with five days to get Slucifer running. You know, approaching the middle of summer, pretty soon here, the days are going to start getting shorter. So each day, it's just clicking by faster and faster. We need to have Slucifer on that new wash plant pad. To hit Parker's target, Mitch plans to drag Slucifer onto a massive 30-foot-high pad. Then, install the super stacker to feed pay dirt up to the top of the 18-foot-high plant, where it will be washed, cleaned of its gold, and the worthless tailings can fall to the ground out of the way, making them easier to remove. Alrighty, she's all lashed up. Shall we? To the top of the mountain, yeah. let's go. The super stacker fixed. The crew must now race to get Slucifer running pay before Parker returns from Alaska. We got a lot of work to do here and we're running out of days already. Super Stacker heading down to the cut. This is the last piece of the puzzle. Parker's crew are nearly ready to fire up Slucifer. First, they have to connect the 120 foot Super Stacker. Looking right there, Mitch. Here we go, the moment of truth. Is it going to lift and is it going to reach the pre wash? Oh yeah, keep it coming up. We are just going to clear the pre-wash. And... Looking good! Oh yeah. Woo! Big moment! This is what we've been waiting for and working at all day, buddy. Let's do it! Here we go, my first scoop of 2022 season in Slucifer. Game's on. This is what it's going to take if we got any shot of getting through all this ground. It's two wash plants running. So it feels good. How's it going? You're washing rocks. Are you guys happy with that setup? Yeah, it seems to be working pretty good. Sweet. As long as the end result is some money, it's all about. Yeah. Well, we're sure spending it like we're making it. How things been going in Alaska? Good. Just me and a couple others, three of us. But we'll just start stripping and build a plant pad and get some stuff sorted out. You're thinking a wash plant setup over there and week and a half or couple so? Couple weeks. All right. I'm gonna go work on a training plan. Do we all need training? For the first time this season, Parker has both his wash plants running pay dirt and is one step closer to mining out the 90-acre airstrip and opening up his Alaska operation. 
boys have wash plants sorted out. So with uh, Sluice for up and running, and we stay on schedule here. At Indian River, Parker finally has two wash plants running. Not long enough for Slucifer to deliver for this week's gold way. Hey! <laughs> Stay out of there. The next thing you hear is gush. <laughs> <laughs> well, doom it back to work for you. <laughs> yeah. So what happened with this conveyor? <laughs> that plug just, the top of it blew right out. I mean, it was just tiny. And the drill sitting up there, they're doing that engine swap on it. On Liam's drill. And like, oh no. It's parked in our yard, right? Don't park your personal vehicle down in the yard. No. OK, you want to see what kind of gold we got? Parker's other wash plant, Big Red, has been sluicing Easy Street Cut pay all week. All right, Chris, what have you got for us? So here we go. 30, 50, 80, 100, 120, 140. Keep her going. 162.85. Worth? over $290,000. For the season, we just broke 1,500, 1,506.6 ounces. Last year, at this time, we were at 863 ounces. Wow. But you gotta remember, we also started sluicing, what, almost, almost two weeks earlier this year? Well, that's the idea. Yeah. We you gotta, gotta keep the push on. 1,500 ounces this early in the season. That's not we're bad almost, at all, guys. We're almost double what we were last exactly. year. Exactly. We're on track for a record season, whether we do it or not. You know, we won't know until we start hogging some of that other ground, but. It's only been one plant up until here. Big Red did a hell of a job. Slucifer's got going now. Things have to work right. You're going to fight. It's going to make or break the season. No pressure. No pressure, but... <laughs> no pressure, but... Uh... Don't f it up. Hey, I found a pressure relief somewhere. <laughs> oh, yeah, Alex is just trying to get rid of pressure for us. Uh, oh, I thought you didn't need that much pressure. Alex, our designated pressure relief man. Yeah. I'm Parker Schnabel, and you're watching Discovery Australia. Hit subscribe now to not miss out on any Gold Rush content.